morning, Don. It's Christina with Infinity of Denver making this video for you. You were actually the first person to really have a look at this car. It just got parked on our lot. Um, literally walked up to the guy, was like, hey, can I grab the keys from you? So you are the first. Um, let's talk a little bit about this car. It's a 2011 Cadillac Escalade. It has 7,300 pounds in towing capacity, 403 horsepower, 417 foot-pounds of torque. It's an all-wheel drive. It's a six-speed automatic transmission. It has 96, 609,000 miles, 6.2 liter, eight-cylinder engine. On the outside of the car, you're looking at a gorgeous pearl paint and white diamond tricoat. The inside is ebony. The stock number on this car is M9478 if you wanna check it out online. The Carfax shows no accidents or damage. On the front, you have high intensity discharge headlights. On the side of the car, you have, of course, really awesome, really cool rims um, with chrome accents all around the car. Right here, you've got a step assist um, in black with chrome accents as well. These mirrors pretty much do it all. They are, um, power folding, dimming, heated. They tilt down when you put the car into reverse. Let's have a look at the side of the car as we walk around it, look at the condition of it. On the back of the car, what we're looking at is LED tail lights. You do have trailer um, trailering equipment underneath that um, cover there. You do have um, hitch wires and um, hitch underneath there as well. You have a power lift gate, rear sonar, and a camera, which we'll look at a little bit closer. Those seven spoke aluminum wheels with all season tires and a luggage rack with center rails on the top. I'm short, so I'll probably have to climb up there so you guys can see it. But here you've got your sonar. The car is a flex fuel vehicle. You've got your backup camera here and of course your power lift gate. With your button up here. You've got a charger here in the back. You can, it looks like you can remove the third row seats, which is definitely different. You've got a number of different adjustments here. And there's the inside of the car. Let me hop on up so you can see um, a look at those roof rails. So here you can see your sunroof, of course, your roof rails with the crossbars for luggage. Let's go ahead, let's hop in the car. Excuse the dinging. In terms of the driver's seat, um, you have a 14-way driver's seat with four-way lumbar support right here. do have the ebony interior heated first and second row seats you have one touch for every single one of your windows here and then of course you've got your fold-in mirrors oh there is your integrated turn signal so you do have an integrated turn signal in there I wasn't completely sure of course you've got memory seating your headlight controls. You do have, of course, steering wheel controls for audio and everything like that, cruise control. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the car. It's a little bit warm in here. You have, um, like I said, the heated uh, seats. Looks like you also have ventilated seats in the front. You do have heated seats in the second row. And there's a look at our second row seats there. We'll hop on back as soon as I'm done up here. There is your sunroof. Your sunroof is a uh, one touch. You can open it up. You can tilt it open with the touch of a button. You of course have your home link, your auto dimming mirror with OnStar included. And then you've got of course your power lift gate control there too. Your um, sunroof also has a wind deflector as well. You have a Bluetooth phone and audio controls. You have tri-zone climate, so you've got climate control for the driver, 
for the passenger as well as in the back of the car. We'll have another look at that when I hop into the back. So you can have three different um, temperatures in the car. You have Nuance Leather Seating in Ebony. Very pretty, it looks like it's in good shape too. I love how it just looks really beautiful, very classy on the inside of this car. You do have a uh, charger, some storage down here, of course your cup holders. We've got two different um, sections here in the center console. It's huge, literally it's huge. Um, and then of course underneath, you've got another charging station here. Looks like you get a free charger in this car as well. And your connectivity for your USB as well. So you can connect your phone that way, charge your phone that way. Um, you do have, of course, navigation, as you can see here. You have adjustable pedals, and you know, I'm not sure that I figured out how to adjust the pedals, but you can adjust the pedals. Kind of looking around, I don't really see anything that might be for that, but um, we can definitely always find out. Oh, it looks like here it is, actually. So you can move your pedals closer or farther away if you're a short person, it's really important. Um, you do have that rear parking assist with that backup camera. So I'm gonna put the car into reverse. And then you've got um, your backup camera there. You have those one touch windows, auxiliary MP3 connectivity. You have XM radio. So you've got a lot of different things here. You have 10 speakers with a Bose 5.1 surround system. So you've got 10 speakers all throughout the car and they are um, Bose speakers. That 5.1 surround sound sounds really really good. I love that you've got a physical clock in here. I think that really adds to the class of the car as well. In terms of safety, let's go over that. You've got an auto crash response, stolen, stolen vehicle assistance, theft deterrent alarm, rollover mitigation, daytime running lights, dual stage front, side head, curtain airbag. So just everything that you could pretty much want in terms of safety. I'm just giving you another look around the cabin here before we hop into the back seat. <clears throat> and that is what it looks like with it all closed up there. Let's go ahead, let's hop into the back and have a look at that. So here is the back of the car second row seats. Looks like you've got the split seating here. So you've got a gap in the middle, which makes it easier for folks to get in and out of the car. There you've got your temperature adjustments, your third row climate control. You have a charger back here as well. Your heated seats, the climate control, and then also audio controls to headphone jack so you can actually listen to different music back here than in the front and you've got your cup holders as well bear with me here i'm going to put the third row of seats up so you can have a look at them you've got your third row seating got cup holders back here as well and I like that these seats have a fold down armrests in the second row that's really nice all right I'm gonna do another walk around the car so you guys can have a look at everything and then let me know if you have any questions Side note, really like that it has the um, shields there. 
kind of on the window, so that really helps with the cut down the wind noise when you're driving around in the car. 